Tell us about uh, this instalment that's been paid to smaller investors. This is a good morning. This is an uh, agreement that they had already made with its customer. It's a retail investor that going to um, um, put 10 percent installment. Um, return this 10% installment to its investors. So it seems like uh, the company is prioritized some of the uh, bor uh, borrowers, uh, their investors, especially retail investors, because this is very important to maintain the social stability. Um, but uh, they still have a lot of debt to pay, so we'll see how this is going. And this story has so many different facets, right, including China's purchasing of a stake in a struggling regional bank, Shenzhen Bank. Uh, the local government asking for this stake for the money to be going to settling debts with the lender. What else do we know about how this saga is getting resolved? So uh, it's, it's the good news is it seems like the government is trying to ring fence the fallout from the Evergrande. We have the uh, um, PBOC has calling into the banks to help stabilize the uh, housing market, which is cooling very fast and easing some mortgage for some home buyers. So it looks like they are fine tuning their policy. They are trying to lead the housing market to a soft landing as opposed to a hard landing.